I'm Susie Sivkov. I've been a notary for more than 10 years and I'm here to help you learn the important steps it takes to become a notary in Texas. Before we dive in, I thought it would be helpful to briefly go over what notaries actually do and to touch on why the state makes applicants go through all of the steps I'll walk you through during this video. Notaries are responsible for verifying a person's identity confirming they're aware of what they plan to sign and that they're not being pressured to sign on that dotted line. Because the purpose of all of this is to protect the public, you'll need to meet a few requirements before you start the notary application process. While some states have more requirements than others, most of them include being 18 or older, being a legal resident of the state, and not having any felony convictions. If you meet all of your state's requirements, you're ready to get started. First up, you'll need to buy the state-required surety bond. Then you'll fill out the Texas Notary Application Form. Next, you'll need to submit your application, proof of your bond, and the filing fee to the Texas Secretary of State. You'll get your commission certificate from the state within a few weeks. When you have the certificate, take it to a Texas notary who's already commissioned. They'll administer your oath of office, notarize the form, and then keep it on file. Next up, you'll need to buy your official Texas notary stamp, journal, and fee schedule. These tools lend trust to the transaction. They help protect the public, and they help protect you if any of your notarizations are questioned. There are a lot of optional supplies to help you carry out your day-to-day -day notary work, too. Consider using a guidebook that shows you the security features to look for when you check a signer's ID. And you might want to get a carry case that locks so you can keep your supplies secure. Now let's talk a little bit about notary errors and omissions insurance. This step is completely optional, but it's one you should seriously consider taking. While notaries should make every effort to avoid mistakes, if an error is made, having an ENO policy protects you as the notary. It's a really inexpensive way to give yourself peace of mind. If you'd like to learn more about becoming a notary, click the link below. Are you ready to become a Texas notary? Then visit us at nationalnotary.org slash Texas.